post taking part, we are using again the same uh, same temperature, 65 degrees Celsius, and we are gonna hold our glass slides here for two minutes. Then we are moving them to 95 degrees Celsius, and we are gonna put them here for five minutes. And after that, we are free to turn on our lights because our process with the SU8 is done. And then we are gonna move to the developing step. What we mean by develop? We are gonna use a special chemical which will remove the unsolidified S2-8 part, which means the part that see the light solidified and that uh, developer, that special chemical, will remove the parts that didn't see the light. So what we are going to end up with a pattern on our glass slide made of S2-8. Now I am going to submerge this S2-8 and glass into the developer, which is a special chemical and it will remove the unwanted parts. From time to time I'm gonna wash my glass like with the alcohol to see if it is developed or not. Now these white strips means it is still developing so I need to put more. Now I am gonna blow the air very gently. Can it be seen? Mm -hmm. The pattern is there. I can still see some white strips, so I might put it more. Got six out of eight. Now we are gonna do the final baking, which we are gonna bake our chips at 250 degrees for 10 minutes, which will increase the rigidity and the bonding of the pattern on the glass slide. Take our glass slide off the top of the hot plate and we wait back in wait to cool down there. And now the next step is we are going to prepare our PDMS solution. This is the prep polymer. We are going to mix these two to prepare our PDMS solution. So the mixing ratio is 10 to 1. Now I am going to prepare 20 grams of this.
they mix, you can see the white parts. pressure in that way the bubbles inside the PDMS will come out. Let's seal our bowl. And this is the pressure meter. Now I'm gonna start the compressor and the pressure will go are already coming out. There is one bubble, but it is between the glass slide, glass slide and the petri, so it is not important for us. But the overall bubbles are gone. Now we need to bake them. Now I'm going to place it to the oven for the baking. Now it is the PDMS is liquidish. After the baking, it will become solid. So we are going to wait more than two hours. Okay, now our chips are ready. We are going to take it out. We leave them to cool down a little bit. And the next step is we are going to cut out of our pattern and we are going to fabricate our 